Hey everybody, welcome to Living Better with Carrie Bond. Uh, I am going to talk to you today about a way that us curly girls can get some volume in our hair. And uh, one of those obvious ways and not so um, hair friendly ways are like um, pulling your hair up and ratting your hair or putting some kind of really stiff hairspray or other product in your hair that makes your hair kind of stay put and stand up but I don't really want that for myself because I want touchable soft curls and um, curls that have some ability to move and be flexible so uh, I have um, these little clips right here and you can see they just open like a little alligator's mouth um, and these can be bought at Sally's Beauty Supply every time I go actually to a specific um, a curly girl specific salon they wind up giving me these uh, so they're pretty cheap and um, they must have them like a ton of them in abundance so anyway I'm gonna show you how to put these clips in your hair okay so where I like to see my volume I know a problem that curly girls have that I have anyway whether my hair is long or short um, my hair tends to be like in a triangle because curls have a lot of volume but they tend to stay like down here and the volume winds up like a triangle because your head is, it goes flat right here and then the poof um, and I that's not attractive to me so anyway um, I like the volume to be noticeable back here at least so if I could stick with this but my hair doesn't tend to stick like that, so midday it'll fall, um, or maybe even earlier than that, just from the weight of the curls, and if you have any product in your hair, the weight of the product as well. So um, I I know that during um, like drying time, you can, if you're using a hair dryer, then there's ways to scrunch your hair up and get the volume that way, but this method is really for when you're able to um, air dry your hair, which is obviously the best um, the best choice for healthy curls uh, not to have any heat on your hair I'm sure you've been told that time and time again so I like to ever since I've went to like a, a curl specific um, salon they've taught me how to clip my hair and then just let it dry naturally if you have that kind of time in the morning if you don't you can actually you can still um, dry it with these in your hair and that's it still works um, I just prefer not to use a hair dryer just because um, I'm trying to do no heat or as little heat as possible on my hair. So let's start. Um, I just grab a section and I don't know parting wise um, a lot of times with the curls I just let them fall where they will and if you don't have a definite um, obvious part it kind of looks better because then the curls just kind of fluff all over the place and it's not so harsh. Um, the part you know if you had a, a part right here and you could you know see the line of the part then it would kind of be harsh it would kind of have to lay down in order to see that so for me it works best if I kind of crisscross these so I'm going to take most of my hair in the back and you lift up I'm going to get a little bit closer lift up and just open that clip and then place it in there um, and you can see that it's kind of standing up um, slanted with the end of this the pinched end up in the air a little bit and that will hold the hair up and give it some volume while it dries so there there's one of them and then I'll go to the other side keeping in mind that that clip is, is standing up right here and I'll go towards uh, the back where that clip is and put one in that side so that there's another place where it's going to be held up so then you have some volume back there and um, both on both sides so it evens it out the height is about the same and then you just place these clips and I just like to move forward with them um, as far up your scalp as I hate that word scalp um, as far up as you want the volume to be created so I like my volume really to be in the back like that and then for this part just to kind of hang down and um, not really have volume up here. I think just on my forehead anyway I just like it to have to have less volume and more volume less volume up here and then more in the back. So I only honestly do about four clips and then I'm good to go. 
um, you can do a lot more and depending on where you want your volume um, of, uh, really depends on how many clips that you uh, decide to put in so you can clip all over the place I mean even if you wanted more less volume up here and then more out here you know you could kind of clip down there to build up some volume on the sides too and then uh, I just wait and let it dry and I do that first thing when my hair is wet and has a little bit of gel product in it um, I actually love the Diva Curl um, products and so I have the uh, gel for those product from those products in my hair uh, before I put these clips in and then I just go about my business about getting ready and by the time um, I arrive at work I just take these out and um, I'm gonna let my hair dry and I'll be back and you can see the results of how my hair stays uh, with some volume without the clips so I'll see you in a little bit okay so I'm dry and I did have to use um, a hair dryer just a little bit so it might be a little bit the hair dryer tends to frizz your hair if you hold it on there a little bit too long there's a fine line between um, the correct drying time that you can use for a hair dryer but as soon as you start seeing it to frizz a little bit then you want to take the hair dryer off of your hair and then just go natural uh, to dry the rest of the way so anyway I'm going to show you that these clips have been in there and then I just reach in there and get them out. Have to dig around in this big nest <laughs> to find the clips and make sure they're all gone. Yeah, that's one thing. I've went into work several times with clips being in my hair, um, just completely forgetting about them, being in a rush. And, and uh, I think, all right, my friends don't even bother to tell me that they're in there, so geez. Okay, so anyway, you can see how um, how much volume my hair has now and um, that is just from those clips and you know how if you sleep on your hair um, sleep on your sleep some certain way on your head uh, that your hair gets bedhead and it lays like that well same concept it's uh, gets dry while the clips are in your hair and you get to have a lot of volume created from having those clips in and your hair drying that way so um, it's such an easy way to get some volume in your hair uh, and if you don't have that kind of time as far as the letting your hair dry naturally um, I'm gonna show a video that pops up at the end of this one that you can look at and see what this little thing is this is um, pretty interesting and I that's my kind of go-to tool when I don't have time to let my hair dry naturally so check it out and I'll see you guys later thanks